is fun. It's a beautiful day for a flight, Adam. Oh, it's always a beautiful day on Eternia, Orko. And I'm sure glad you cleaned up your room so you could go for a spin with me. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> My room. Hmm. You, uh, did clean your room, didn't you? Uh, oh, yeah. Well, I mean, uh, well, not exactly. I, I, I mean, uh... uh... Orko. Well, <laughs> no. I, I forgot. Then I'm sorry, Orko, but you have to go back. Ah, oh, Adam. Uh... No arguing, Orko. Adam! Adam, you must come to Grayskull immediately. On my way, sorceress. Then suppose I promise to clean my room twice tomorrow. Orko, the sorceress has just called me. Get back to the palace and tell Man-at-Arms, will you? Ah, goodness. Oh, sure, Adam, no problem. skiddle do skiddle day off to the palace. I'm on my way. I wonder what the sorceress wants. Thank you for coming so quickly, Adam. From the sound of your voice, it must be pretty important. It is. I am receiving signals of distress from Shira on Etheria. My sister? What can I do? She needs your help, Adam. You must go there as soon as possible. I'll go now. Open the portal, please. Very well, Adam. But I must warn you, I sense you are heading into danger. If my sister needs me, there's no time to lose. Goodbye, sorceress. Sorceress said this place might be dangerous. She wasn't joking. Adam, welcome back to Ethereum, my brother. You came at a good time. Shira, <coughs> what's going on? War, Adam. I'll explain later. Excuse me. Shield! Everyone all right? Thanks to you, Shira. Oh, great. Born troopers. I'll have to become He-Man. By the power of Grayskull! <laughs> But you cannot fight so many horde troopers alone. She won't be alone. Your concern is appreciated, sir, but this is our job. Leave while you still can. My sister and I will handle these tin cans. I wish I were as confident as you. I wish I were as confident as I sound. Boy, there sure are a lot of them. I wish there was another way. Right. We don't want to hurt anyone. That water tower. Good idea, brother. Not a moment too soon. Ready? Whatever you are. Go! Took care of them. Come on, we have to get to the mines. Those guys don't give up easy. 
easily. Wardak is quick to punish any of his troops that don't win. Mount up! Fly, Swift Wind! Fly! Let's get out of here, Swift Wind. Back to the mine. Shira. Eternia's golden boy is helping the rebels again, is he? Where is he now? <laughs> With she and the rest of the rebels, they have taken the villagers to the Ethereum mines for safety. Safety? Nothing is safe from the wrath of Hordak. The Horde owns that mine, Mantenna. Yes, mighty Hordak. And we own that village. Yes, your, your wonderfulness, ma'am. And we own those people! How dare they rebel against us! No matter what it takes, we must teach them a lesson. The village of Dryle shall be an example to all Etheria of what happens to those who defy the Horde. Is anyone left in the village? No, 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 no merciful greatness. Uh... Then burn it. <laughs> They're burning the village. Then what are we waiting for? We have to stop them. No, He-Man. We stay here. These people need us. But the, their homes, their possessions. They mean nothing. Houses we can build again, He-Man. And as for our possessions, we gladly traded them for one thing we did not have, our freedom. You mean you just let the Horde destroy your village? This is Etheria, my brother. The Horde rules this planet. If they did not destroy the village now, they would do it later, and the villagers might be harmed. What caused the Horde to attack the village anyway? I will tell you. We were slaves, forced to work in the mines, digging Ethereum for the Horde. The Horde uses Ethereum to power their machines. They had a huge robot to watch over us. We could not leave the mine until we'd filled the bin with Ethereum. Then, yesterday, the Ethereum ran out. There was no more in the mine. The robot grew angry. It fired on us, drove us back into the mine. It would have kept us there forever, were it not for Shira. destroyed the robot and set us free from the Horde's slavery. Free. Our whole village wants to join the rebellion. We will never be slaves again. I guess Hordak wasn't too pleased to hear that news. As you can see, the Horde will be here soon. We'll need every bit of help we can get. All the other rebels are in Bright Moon, so I'm glad you're here. I'm not sure even the two of us will be able to stop that army. You'd better go get the other rebels. But the Horde is coming. I can't leave these people alone. They won't be alone. I'll be with you. Hurry, Swift Wind. The rebel army is a long way away. We have to bring them back and help He-Man. And we don't have much time. Well, it's quite an army. Yes, and Hordak himself is leading them. I think he plans to make an example of us, to discourage others from joining the rebellion. And they aren't going to let us run away, either. That was just a warning, rebels! You will not get another! Surrender, or else! We will never surrender. Then we might as well let Hordak know that. Say, well, they'll regret it. Troops, freeze rays, full strength. Here we go. Get back, Colin. You cannot hold them forever, He Man. What can I do? Do you have any weapons? No, only mining tools. Is there another way out of this mine? No. Then you'd better let me handle this. And we'd better pray that Shira comes back soon. I'm very worried about leaving the villagers, but at least He-Man is with them, and we do need the help of the rebels. Shira, look! 
<gasps> Waspoids. The horde attack robots. Looks like trouble, Swifty. Let's move it. Let them come closer. Did you say closer? I did. That's what I thought you said. One more down. Sword to staff. That takes care of them. But I wonder how He-Man is doing. I don't know how much longer I, I can hold off these freeze rays. Oh, I wish Hordak would give up and go home. Oh, this is taking too long. Speed fire! Now what? Troopers, when I give the word, you will all fire at once. He-Man can't stop all our freeze rays, and I shall fire the Crawler's giant freeze cannon. Uh-oh. Fire! <laughs> Why bother, Mantenna? We have wasted enough time with those paltry rebels. Let them dig themselves out. <laughs> dig themselves out? That's funny. You think so, Mantenna? <laughs> then why aren't I laughing? Maybe you didn't get it. <laughs> Come closer, Mantenna. Hmm? You heard me. Closer. I'm glad we're not back in your throne room, because... <laughs> now, that's funny! Back to the Fright Zone! Hey, man are you alright? I... I got hit... with a... freeze ray. I won't be able to move for, for some time. But the mine entrance is blocked. The air in here will run out soon. Well, where's Shira? Why isn't she here to save us? Yes. Where is she now that we need her? Shira went to get help. What she about us? Here. Hold it. Hold it. I am ashamed of you people. You said you wanted freedom, but when it gets difficult, you become frightened. Freedom is the most valuable thing we can have. It never comes easy. We have to work for it. We can be grateful for the help of She-Ra and He-Man, but we should never expect it. We can never have freedom unless we can count on ourselves. So let's get to work and get out of this mine. But, but how? The entrance is blocked. We have mining tools in the rear of the mine. But the horde may still be outside. There's... <laughs> there's more than one side to a mountain. If we drill a little farther, we'll come out on the other side. And freedom! And to freedom! Bring He-Man to the rear of the mine. This air is already growing thin. We must work quickly for our lives and our freedom. And He-Man is with them, but we need everyone. And quickly. Drile. Yes, I know where that is. We'll start immediately, Shira. But it will take some time to get there. And time is just what we don't have. Come as fast as you can, my friends. But as for me, I must hurry back now. Let me go with you. No, Bo. Swift Wind could not fly as fast with you here. And we must fly fast to He-Man. I can feel he needs me. I sense a great danger. How goes the digging, Colin? We're almost there, He-Man, but this air is growing very thin, and we have no more supports for this new tunnel. The whole thing may collapse. If only I could get up. Rest yourself, He-Man. That freeze ray has not worn off yet. Where are you going? To work. I may be tired, but I can still swing a pickaxe. We need all the workers we have. We're back in Drile, Swift Wind. No sign of the Horde. Oh, I hope we're not too late. Oh, the mine entrance. It's completely sealed. Oh, no. Wait. 
Do you hear that? It came from behind the mountain. Go, Swift Wind! Light! Oh, we're through the mountain! Oh, no! Hurry! Enlarge the hole! We have to get out of here! I must get up! Come, He-Man, lean on me! The roof is collapsing! We must hurry! No, you go! I must hold it. Hurry! Before it's too late! Go! Now! Quickly! Come out of there! Shira! He-Man is still in there! What? He kept the mine from caving in so we could escape. He-Man? He-Man! I'm coming to get you! Oh, please be all right. Adam! Hello, brother. Shira, I... I thought I was dreaming. The villagers, did they get out? Safe and sound. And from what I hear, thanks to you. Now, what's all this I hear about you not wanting to leave here? Well, I, I think I'm ready now, but I'm sure going to miss this place. I was getting kind of attached to it. Mm hmm I'll bet. Come on, let's go. Sis? Thanks. Any time, brother. Any time. And so are you, Colin. All of you. Do you know where you are? No. No, we were never allowed to leave the village, but it's very beautiful here. This is Whispering Woods. Here, the Horde does not rule. Your people are free at last. That's right. Looks like you saved the day without us, Shira. Well, I did have a little help. Of course, it was all in the family. Isn't there anything for us to do? Why don't you take our new friends to the camp and help them get settled? With pleasure. Come along, folks. Now that this business is over, I think it's time for me to leave. I was afraid of that. Well, please give mother and father my love. I look for the day we'll all be together. That day will come, Shira. Someday all of our worlds will live in peace and there will be no reason to fight or to fear what tomorrow may bring. I pray it will be soon. Oh, hello, Arco. Yeah, I'm back, so if your room's clean, we can go for that spin now. I can't, Adam. Now man at arm says I have to clean up this paint I spilled. Oh, boy. What's a guy got to do to get a little freedom these days? Hmm. Well, Arco, you know, sometimes freedom is pretty hard work. But then again, it's worth it. Yes, Arco, it certainly is worth it.